Want to know how to fold a crane but don't know how? My friend Leanne's about to tell you. Bum -ba -da -da, bam! Thanks, Derek. Okay, so what you'll need to do to get started is get a 6x6 six six inch piece of paper and if it's colored, go ahead and have the color facing down and you want to fold the piece of paper hot dog style. Or is it a hamburger? No, it's definitely a hot dog. Okay, so make sure your creases are nice and firm. Go ahead and unfold. Turn the paper around and again, Derek, it is hot dog style. That's a cheeseburger. Crease it. Crease it. Nice. Open it up. Flip it around and go ahead and fold into... Sailor's hat? Sure, Derek. A sailor's hat. Hey, our model Joanne sure has some nice hands, huh? They, they are quite beautiful. She's got nice creases going on, too, don't you think? Those are some fine creases. Go ahead and fold the piece of paper again into a sailor hat. And go ahead and crease. Our hand model is Joanne, for those of you who are wondering who Joanne is. And step two. Unfold the piece of paper, and you should be left with eight creases. How many, Derek? Hachi. Now it might get a little complicated, but with just the creases that you've created, go ahead and fold into them to create this perfect diamond. And you want to have the flaps on the bottom. Step three! Place the paper exactly as shown. Fold the raw edges to the middle, like so. Again, crease it real good. Do the same on the other side. Crease it. No one wants to hear you sing, Leanne. Sorry. I beg to differ. Anyhow, once your paper looks like that, go ahead and turn it over and do the exact same step with the flap on the bottom. And crease away. As you may notice, there is a lot of creasing. In this process, you want it sharp crisp and every adjective you can think of when it comes to creasing. Let's just move to step four right now, all right? Step four. Now with the top triangle part, you want to go ahead and fold it down to create yet another crease. Unfold that and open the two flaps and you should get this image of a perfect diamond. Make sure that you turn the paper around and repeat the steps on the opposite side. Up to where that crease you just created was, go ahead and lift. Now open the monster's mouth and fold right along those creases that we told you to create. Look at that perfect fold. Nice. Now step five. Step five. Go ahead and fold that piece of paper over. Again, single flap up to the crease and, like Derek said, monster mouth. Fold into the creases. Nice, sharp, crisp. Nice, we made it to step six. Fold the outer edges to the middle. Make sure the flappy side is down. Yes, the flappy side. Make sure it's down. And crease. And go ahead and do the same thing to the other side. And crease again. Step seven. Turn that piece of paper around and repeat. Again, you want to make nice aligned folds here. And again, crease, crease, crease. Same thing on the other side. Make sure everything is aligned and looks very neat. And you want to go ahead and again, crease, crease, crease. Should end up with something like this. Step eight. Okay, you've made it this far. Go ahead and fold into the crease. Turn the piece of paper over and again, flip over. 
that edge till you get something that looks like this. Step nine. Okay, now to the center fold, we're gonna go ahead and put that corner all the way up and crease. Go ahead and turn the piece of paper around and do the exact same step. Very nice, Leanne. Very nice. Thank you. Step 10! So similar to turning a page of a book, go ahead and flip over that flap, turn the whole thing over, and again, flip over the flap again. Almost there, guys. So now at this state, you're almost done. So you just got to pinch the bottom. And you want to pull the tips that peek out to the top right and the left. As you can see, the crane is starting to take shape. After you've pulled both necks out, create one for the head. Cranes have a decent size head, so go about a quarter of the way down. So we're done. Thanks for watching, guys. So just send your crane and a wish or promise for social justice into interim CDA, and Leanne will take care of the rest. Thanks for watching. Thanks for watching. Bye.